The project is located at Chuaneng Diamond Mine in Botswana, in the southwestern region of Africa, approximately 150 kilometers west of the capital Khabarone, in the Naledi River Valley. Chuaneng means a place of small stones, and the mine is a partnership between De Beers and the government of Botswana. The open cast pit consists of three Kimberlite pipes which have been mined since 1982. The mine maintains an ISO 14001 health and safety system. To maintain the safety requirements, Debswana approached Macaferry SA to propose a solution for potential rockfall problems on cut 6. Specifically bench 12 to bench 20 above the main haulage road in the pit. Mid-2009, Macaferry SA, in joint venture with the consultants Mellis and Duplessis and the contractors Webex, assessed the risk and defined the solution. Mellis and Duplessis designed the solution. Macaferry SA managed the contract and supplied the materials, while Webex was appointed the installer of 53,000 square meters of drapery system. The solution proposed that loose rocks be forced to fall in a controlled manner by means of breaking the kinetic energy which is generated by the residual material and thus prevent their impact onto the main hall road directly beneath the slope. Dead man anchors in the form of Macaferry gabions were used to secure the top of the drape mesh system. These were buried below surface, around which the mesh was wrapped as a starting point. Additionally, 25 mm diameter anchors were drilled and secured down to a depth of 3 meters vertically, and then encased with grout of 25 MPA strength in accordance with the design. Transverse cables were attached to these anchors which were used to guide the steel grid drape mesh system down the face of the slope. The combination of steel cables and double twist mesh allows for a lower net deformation, a higher global strength and a greater capacity to contain debris. The steel grid was delivered to site in three meter wide rolls, connected on site to form six meter wide panels. These panels were rolled onto a patented decoiling machine, which was developed by Webex, in order to decoil the drape mesh system down the face of the slope. This method of installation allowed an effective 1,000 square meters of steel grid to be installed per day. The panel dimension on the decoiler is six meters wide by 200 meters long thereby reducing the lacing time on the slope and any associated risks. The mesh is strengthened with a steel rope laced into the edge, which also serves as a mechanism used to connect adjacent panels to each other. The decoiler is controlled remotely and proceeds slowly down the slope to cope with the slope surface topography. This reduces the number of rope access staff on the covered area which in turn also reduces rocks tumbling down during installation. All overlapping of the drape mesh system was joined on the slope face by trained rope access personnel. The steel grid MO being completely decoiled down the slope would restart at the top of each adjacent roll to be installed. Good attention to all safety aspects resulted in no loss of life or any injury caused to the vehicle operators. The bottom of these panels was secured by a cable rope at the toe of the slope. The steel grid MO has a net effect, whereby it controls the speed of the rockfall whilst the kinetic forces are discharged through the steel cables towards the rock anchors, which have been secured into the top of the slope. The project duration was seven months. It began in November 2009 and was completed in June 2010. This is an example of the total area with drapery in place. A significant aspect of the solution is the rapid supply which took only 45 days from the production of the system
to delivery at the point of installation. The area which needed to be protected was 53,000 square meters. The steel grid MO falls under the category of a simple drapery system. This approach is referred to as a passive measure as the rockfall is controlled as it occurs. The materials in the system are classed as a geocomposite consisting of two different materials, double twist mesh woven together with steel cable. Its product identification is Steel Grid MO. This joint venture with Macaferry SA as project managers was completed without incident and on time. There was no major disruption to production and provided a cost-effective, durable and safe solution to a rockfall mitigation problem at Juaneng Mine. This rockfall mitigation project, successfully undertaken by Macaferry SA, is the largest of its kind in Africa.